Hey everyone, it's Joe for Joey Super Cool Food Reviews. I'm back. How are you doing today? I'm at the Green Burrito. Uh, and you can find these at Carl's Jr. slash Hardee's restaurants. So it's a joint effort between the uh, restaurants. And so it's the Green Burrito's new chicken and cheese enchiladas, everyone. I think it was like three, I think it could be like 350 and change. So this is what it comes in, a little box, you can see. And um, it's um, chicken and cheese, like I said. Um, comes with, uh, you know, the enchilada sauce, the cheese, you can see. And um, yeah, so, you know, it's your basic little enchiladas. And I thought the price wasn't bad. So, but look at this big, huge container they put it in, you know? I think it would have been looked nicer if it was like in a black container, but you know, they kind of went cheap, but whatever. So let's give it a shot. It's the new chicken and cheese enchiladas from Carl, I mean, Carl's Jr. slash the green burrito, everyone. So we're gonna give this a shot. Now let's try this out. So first of all, let's see. You can see the chicken in there and the melted cheese. And look at that. That look good? So let's try this. Hmm. Okay. So the enchilada sauce is, is good. I can tell there's cumin in this. But you know, it's a, your typical canned enchilada sauce. Just fine. You know. Mm-hmm. Woo, 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 woo. The uh, chicken, you can see, I don't know if they're using the chicken from, I don't know what, kind of, what the, they're using the chicken for, but the chicken to me is, kind of tastes, um, it could have been cooked more. It's a little, I don't want to say raw, but it's a little chewy. Yeah, I wonder what it would yeah. Those are more of like a fajita chicken strips. I would eat more of like a shredded chicken. I think it would have been a lot better. Let's try this. Yeah, I don't know. And the tortilla, let's see. Kind of cut this. This is just this is gross. Huh. Yeah. And it looks kind of like it's not cooked all the way. So, so the enchilada sauce is good. The cheese is good. You can't go wrong with the cheese, but I wasn't. I didn't care for the chicken. I think they should use a shredded chicken instead of this like fajita style chunk and it doesn't taste like it's cooked all the way through as I'm eating it. <laughs> I'm gonna get Ebola from that. Woo woo woo! <laughs> wow. So on a scale of one to ten, the green burritos, chicken and cheese enchiladas. This is a five. You know, the chicken was felt like it was undercooked which could be dangerous as I just ate this all, right? And, uh, but everything else was good, but it's all about the chicken, right? So this gets a five in my book and you know, it's too bad. They could have done it, they could have done it good. You know, I mean, how good could you be, you know, get, you know, at a QSR restaurant, but whatever, it's, it's what it is. So that's my story and I'm sticking to it. Carlos Jr. Chicken and Cheese Enchiladas is getting a five today. Oh well. well, I wouldn't order this again. So try something else in the menu, okay? okay. Anyway, some quick shout outs, everyone. Quick shout out to, uh, let me see here. Larry S. Another shout out to Maddie 301 Another shout out to Liam T. <laughs> and another shout out to Mario Luis. Thanks, everyone. Check out my tweets and tweets and everything in between. Tell everybody I said hi. The channel's growing because of you. Tell a friend about Joy's World Tour and tell them to subscribe, okay? Check out my playlists and all my other videos. Thank you so much. This is Joe from Joey's Super Cool Food Review saying peace.
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>